It's resolution 22-2013 in recognition of Patricia Trish Hamilton. Where as effective August 1, 2013, Trish Hamilton will retire as a Transylvania County employee. And whereas Trish started work with Transylvania County in 1987 and assisted the county's economic development commission. Since 1996, she has served in the role of program support assistant for the planning and economic development department. And whereas as part of her 26 years of service to Transylvania County, Trish has been a vital member of the planning and economic development department and has successfully worked on many planning and economic development related projects and activities. Whereas Trish is extremely gifted in PowerPoint presentations, designing marketing information, including the department's e-newsletter e and website and brochures such as the business resource guide. And whereas many of our existing business and nonprofits rely on Trish for her knowledge and expertise regarding economic development, facts and information, and whereas Trish provides a valuable source of knowledge that she readily shares with not only existing and new businesses, but other county departments, and whereas throughout her years Trish has earned the admiration, respect, respect and friendship of those with whom she has worked and come into contact with. Now, therefore, be it resolved by the Transylvania County Board of Commissioners to recognize Trish upon her retirement and to express our appreciation for her years of service to the county and the citizens of our community. Be it further resolved by the Transylvania County Commissioners to extend to Trish best wishes for many years of good health and happiness during her retirement and her future endeavors. This is the 22nd day of July, 2013. Sarah Motion. Second. Second. We move in second. Any questions or comments? I just, sure. want, sorry. I just want to hear you say planning and economic development. This is Trish one last time. <laughs> <laughs> it is the most impressive thing you have ever heard. Let me tell you, if you haven't dialed the office, make a point of doing it in the next three days because it is the best. <laughs> Thank you, Trish. Okay. Are you serious? I love it. I love calling out. Okay. Good morning, planning and economic development. This is Trish. <laughs> <laughs> Trish, thank you. You got big shoes. You're going to leave big shoes to fill. We appreciate your service and always. Uh, kind word and a friendly smile to those coming into office and we see in the community as well. So you're going to be missed, but I'm sure hopefully we'll see you around and not take off. I want to know how you're going to deal with that full time. <laughs> 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 you haven't got that answer right. <laughs> thank you. Thank you again. Trish, I just want to say thank you. Sorry, my microphone's not working. So. I just wanted to say thank you for all those tasks that you do that nobody really realizes it. Who did it? Just that it, it got there. And you, you've made a tremendous impact on our community. A lot of people really don't realize how much you've done. I remember for several years I worked directly across the hall. And I was remembering briefly when we were having some of those major layoffs, how you and others were helping us put packets together for our affected citizens above and beyond what your normal job duties were. That's just one example of me. I just want to say that. And I guess finally, before we move, I would add that uh, just what's been said already, we have a small department. Planning and economic development is a small department. And so the people, and there's only three people, two and a half people, or three people in that department. And, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to think about Bill Layton, whether he's a full or what was said earlier in terms of the, the amount of work and the variety of work that has to be done by a very small department. Unless you see it, there's no way for you to know just how remarkable that is. And Trish leaving is going to be a huge hole, as, as I think Daryl said, or Larry said, it's, it's big shoes to fill. And, and uh, we hate that you go. One other thing that I would say on a personal note, it's a small town, and Jack is my cousin. And, uh, and, and he, he lives right across from my office. And, uh, uh, Larry talked about uh, Trish, or Jack dealing with Trish. It's the other way around. Trish dealing with Jack. Or Trish dealing with Jack. It's the other way around. Jack's life is about to change. <laughs> so, uh, so on that note, if there are no more comments, all those in favor of the motion signify by saying aye. Aye. aye.
for saying that. so many years. Uh, lots of changes. I've seen all the plants close, but I know that there are others coming. I do want you all to know, I know you're here for the moratorium, and I, I'm going, oh my goodness, what a night to have to stand in front of all you people because you think we're the ones that have brought the, the bad things in. But <laughs> I do want to say that planning, the planning board, and the Economic Development Board and staff have always and will always have Transylvania County's best interest at heart. Don't give them such a hard time. They are, they are working for you, not against you. Thank you. When Trish and I started working together, Keith McCoy came up and said that uh, there's no way we would be able to last six months. <laughs> well, that's not quite true. We've managed to work together since 1994 and then both in the same department since 96. I would say that Trish has managed to keep all of her hair. I have not. <laughs> <laughs> um, one of the things that I really appreciate about Trish is that in the work that we've done, She's always focused on work, but family has always been very important to her. And I'd like to just recognize very quickly her mom, Opal, who's coming from Arkansas and is here to help celebrate. She has her son, Matt, and her daughter, Ashley, are both here. Uh, Tracy is here, Matt's wife, and the grandchildren. So, uh, Trish, thank you very much. And your family, thank you. I think I can speak on behalf of many different board chairs, planning board and economic development. The Trish has done an outstanding job. She has helped carry this county forward, working with different boards, trying to adjust, change, and adapt over a number of years. Um, the work has already been identified, and Commissioner Chapel so eloquently said, a lot of what we do is not visible. It's just not. It is dealing with a constituent that has a concern, it's trying to help a business that needs some factual information for something. And yes, uh, trying to fill that void over the next six months as we introduce Michelle McCall into that position is going to be a challenge, but we'll have to. So, with that, we will have a celebration for Trish, any and everyone invited to that. That's this Friday at 2 p.m. in the Community Service Conference Room. Thank you. Trish, thank you. Thank you.